Um, I found some notes recently, and I want to share them. Uh, actually, like some different books and different things collected. Just very powerful keys. So, goes. You shall love the Most High, your Lord, with all your heart, all your soul, and with all your might. He sure said that. O oh, Ajarna, the highest God, in whom all beings abide, and who pervades the entire universe, is reached only by wholehearted devotion. Only by tireless devotion can I be seen and known. Only thus can a man become one with me, O oh, Ajarna. Verily, those who surrender their actions to me, who muse on me, worship me, and meditate on me alone with no thought save me. O oh, Ajarna, I rescue them quickly from the ocean of life and death, for their minds are fixed on me. If we can fix our mind on the Almighty and keep the Creator forefront in our mind then, you know, we could reach a state of peace in life. Um, one way of doing that is through chanting. Chanting is something that you can do anywhere, at any time, you know, get some beads and be chanting in your head and your mind silently. It's a good habit to match your chanting with deep breathing also. It helps you feel that love even deeper to breathe it in just accept it into every cell of your body another method of loving the Lord with all your heart mind and soul is just being appreciative um, for all of the blessings that are in your life you know just sitting down and thinking about you know all the different blessings in your life one by one, all the things that you're grateful for. Uh, if you're singing, to be singing about the Creator, to, you know, devote all of your actions to the Almighty. And uh, yeah, that's one of the keys, it's one of the ways to, you know, find a place of peace in life. Why not?